Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and if you're new here, my name is Esther Moffrey. In today's video, I want to share with you one of my best strategies that uh, I've never shared here before and it is called ABM strategy. This is one of the strategies that if you have been blowing accounts uh, and because this is something that everyone does when you come to this industry, you will blow your account, you will lose money. This strategy will help you from seeing those big negatives to start seeing profit in your trading and today i want to introduce you the abm strategy and how i will do it i don't want to give the whole strategy on how it does because it will take time these are strategies that i need to take to have more time with a student or with a trader to really tell them even if they advance they are they're beginner to really uh tell them what i've come to realize what really happens in the market so today i'll just do the part of this strategy and what i've come to understand is that when people are given something for free sometimes they don't even value it sometimes they think that ah, it's just another strategy so i'm putting out there abn strategy i'll just give a ta a, like um a tip uh, not even a tip i'll just give uh one sector of it and if you want the full strategy you can buy this strategy it's just 80 dollars it's uh, it's eighty dollars. If you're in Kenya, it's eight thousand. Eight thousand means that you can have a class where I can teach you this strategy one on one via Zoom or physical. If you can, be, you can meet me where I am. So, guys, I'm telling you that this strategy is one of the best. If you're blowing account, you need a BM strategy strategy to know why you're doing so. So today, I will just give you the 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 how can i say i'll just give you because it has three levels i'll give you the one level so abm stands for approach so there's b i won't say in this video b stands for what and i'll not say in this video c stands for what so that when you get this strategy even if you have the a the approach you are good to go so for you uh, this strategy, it's you'll just get one level, but if you want to have the full strategy, I've said I'll be charging $80 for any strategy. If you want WBB strategy one-on-one -on -one class, if you want any any of my strategy to teach you, the class is two hours. If you want me to teach you any of my strategy, you have to pay $80. That is 8,000 Kenya shillings. And if you don't have, just stick here. I give these strategies for free. So guys, what is ABM? I've told you ABM stands for three words and I will not say the B what stands for and I will not say what C stands for. But with an, with, even with the A, you can be able to trade this strategy. So ABM stands for approach. B stands for, I won't say today, but if you uh, come and buy the strategy, I'll be very very okay to give you what it means so let's go and dive into the the chart so this strategy i saw it yesterday when i was trading and for sure if you had this strategy you would have made money or you have you would have stayed away out of the market so this is aud we have seen so uh let me delete this we can i have told you that don't be against the trade always be a uh, uh, with the trend, we can see that very clearly that this is a downtrend. And what do we do as most traders? We want to know when can we dive in because the minute the market has um, break broke a very key zone, we we know the market broke this key zone. We have said the market is downtrend. We know it has broken this very key zone. So our 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 question is as in when is the end of this retest? Because we know this is a retest. The buyers pushing the market up, we, we are very aware that this, this market is not a buy trend. We know it's just a pullback. So when do you get in? So what, what happened yesterday, the market, I'll just, I'll just uh, use the playback. And then when I was waiting to really understand when is the end of the market, I get this very, very big momentum candle. And this is where our ABM strategy now comes in. The minute you get momentum candle, because ABN strategy, you have to deal it whenever you have momentum in the market. You cannot apply ABN strategy with a very, very small candles, indecision candle, weak rejections. ABN strategy only apply whenever you see momentum in the market. So ask yourself, we have a very big red candle. It's bearish. It has already engulfed. 
we have that uh, in mind. So many people would come and sell, and I'll tell you why. Because it has engulfed, you think it's the end of retest, and you think this momentum, there's nothing else the market can do rather than continuing down. And guys, many people will put their sell positions here. But with my ABM strategy, you will now start with the first level. And the first level of A is approach. Ask yourself, where is, is this volume approaching? Yes, we have momentum in the market, but the approach, because everyone will put uh, will put a sell there. They will enter sell. They put their stop loss above that uh, high, and they think the market cannot go against them. Why? Because they think with this big candle, there is no there is no way the market can 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 reverse and starts going up. It's the end of reverse. But I'll tell you, if you use ABM, if you use ABM now, ABM. So, number one, you're asking yourself, A stands for approach. So, let's ask ourselves, where is this volume, of, uh, the volume of the market, the volume of this big candle? Where would it be approaching? And we can see it is approaching this level that has not been broken. So, if the level that the market is trying to approach is either near, near I mean below 50 pips, or it is at that zone, you do not enter sell even if the momentum is as uh, is how big the abm will protect you because the a stands for approach you know these market makers they just want to give you to print this momentum or to fake this momentum in the market so that they can trap in sellers and maybe reverse the market or continue with buy so with this strategy if you ask yourself, what does A stands for? It stands for approach. So whenever you see a momentum candle, and guys, if you don't know what momentum candle means, it means either a green candle or a red candle. Red represents sell, green represents buys. So if you have momentum candle red, ask yourself, what is the approach? And that is what will make you difference. Because let me tell you for sure, People blow account with momentum candles. You'll never blow your account with indecisions candle, with weak rejections candle. Why? Because whenever there's weak rejection and the, the, whenever there's the weak rejection, the market, the price tends to go back where you entered. But if the market is momentum, candle after candle after candle, momentum after momentum, and maybe you had imagine that person who entered at this level, this is what I mean. If you bought here, just because if you bought at that level, just because the market had broken the resistance, you can imagine this huge momentum candle, it was used to trap in buyers and they even made it to break. So you need to understand that even if I get momentum candle, I need to to group it in the ABM and the first of ABM is approach. So you would have said, yes, the market, we see like it has broken here, but if what if it is approaching this zone? There's a zone here. There's a zone here, very defined zone. What if the market is just on this zone? You see, there was a zone there. There was a, there was this zone. So if you had asked yourself, what if it was just approaching this zone? Let me give it time and I see if the market will still continue to buy. But guess what? The market reversed and trapping buyers, they made sure that market will never come back. Even up to this time, it has never come back. So let me tell you, if you bought here and you had a very big lot size, what has destroyed or what has killed your account? It's the momentum that has come in. So just be very, very careful whenever you see momentum in the market. Be very, very careful. Why? Because if there is momentum in the market, the market, the price tends not to come back to where you entered. So there is no mistake. If you do mistakes with momentum, you are done. So today I'm teaching you, if you see any momentum in the market, your first question to ask yourself, where is the approach? An approach I can give you for free. This is for free, guys. The approach, it is either it's approaching resistance 
or the market is approaching support. It's that easy. So ask yourself, yes, I have a very big candle. Where is my support? Where, if it's a red candle, where is my support? If it's a green candle, where is my resistance? And if the market is near the support or near resistance or is just at the resistance, don't do anything just because it's a momentum candle. Now let's see what happened. After that momentum candle, buyers started to come in and the market started to push up. You can imagine the frustration of anyone who had entered that market thinking it will go down and the market continued to the market continued to go up. And what I can tell you guys is that the minute you have a cert certain market, like, uh, you have volume in the, in the charts, it is easier to be trapped. It is very easy to be trapped. You need a system to govern your brain and your mind to tell you that I don't need to trade right now because it is, yes, it's a momentum candle, but it's approaching resistance. It's approaching support. So guys, I'll give you with another example with GBPJPY. Let me give you with GBPJPY and I tell you what really happened. GBPJPY. So this we have GBPJPY there and I'll give you an example. So you can see that the market has been going down and then we have this momentum candle. It's bearish engulfing candle. And many of the times we think, why is this market going? Uh, we have bearish candle. So we need to sell. And this is our take profit, guys. I've told you what. If you get this momentum candle in the market, ask yourself, what is the approach? What is the next support? Because if it is a red bearish candle, it's a bearish candle. Uh, of course, we are looking for support. So you'll come and mark your support. Support is here. And then we want to, we want to measure how many pips to support if we are entering. So if you are entering, how many pips? There are almost 45 pips. So is it worth to risk, uh, this market for 45 pips? No. So whenever you get this market, because it is approaching this zone, the support zone, it is approaching here. You would have said the market is already even touching uh, that zone. So let me wait and see. And guys, let's see what happened after the red candle. So the market, it started to flip. It started to flip, going to the to other direction. And everyone is confused. We need sell, we need to buy. And eventually the market just started going to the opposite direction. So what ABM does for you, you will even know how to... Um, you will even know how to to switch sides sides very very quickly, and you can see even up to now the market is still buying. So there are so many sellers that have been trapped. So Audi USD, GBP JPY, GBP Audi did the same. Even GBP Audi, they gave us a very momentum candle, and guess what? After that, after giving us a momentum candle, they made the market go down. So don't be don't be um very very happy when you see momentum in the market so if you see this momentum in the market many people will say what it's a it's a bullish engulfing candle but if you use abm strategy and a stands for approach you will say the market wants to approach this resistance so what is the need and we know at resistance it can be rejected or it can break why would you want to be in a trade where you are guessing what will happen so what i can tell you so what I can tell you guys, if the approach is few me, few pips away, this is 33 pips, don't even bother. And you can see what happens. Let me show you what happens. Immediately after that huge candle, the market started to go down. So guys, what I can tell you is that don't be so much happy with, um, don't be happy with uh, very big momentum candles. Always ask yourself, is my candle approaching? And if it's approaching, where is my support? Where is my resistance? So that you won't be trapped because market makers are there to trap you and they will trap you to think there is momentum. And then when you sell, they shift the market to buy. So if you want the rest of this strategy where I can teach you one on one, because at this mo moment, even the approach, there are so many things I can, I can teach, but because of time and you know, I don't know, I, I don't have that time to explain in details. You can buy that strategy at $80 or 8,000 Kenya shillings. So guys, I have over 10, 10 strategies. So if you feel like you want any of the strategies, just 
tell me on the comment section and I'll give you my email. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.